Get ready to match the stars. Bill Daly, Brett Summer, Jack Carter, Danny Flagg, Richard Dawson, and Judy Carr as we play the star-studded Big Money Match Game 73. And now here's the host of Match Game 73, Gene Raver. Hello there. Thank you very much. How's Johnny Olsen? Good. Thank you. We've got a very lively bunch here today, John. We thank you for showing up here wherever you are. I'd like to say hello to our celebrated bodies over here. Thank you for showing up. We couldn't do it without you. I'd like to welcome two people who have not been with us before, Bill Daly and Judy Carn. Judy and I have worked together before. Yes. Oh. yes. Shall we do that? Would you welcome Judy Matchett? This fellow, of course, we all know and love from uh, his appearance on the Bob Newhart Show and other uh, ventures that he's involved in. He and I have a lot in common, and I'm very happy to have you here, Bill. Thank what you do you have much. in common? <laughs> a lot in common. Thanks for getting me on the show. Don't <laughs> touch me. You're both good kissers, aren't That's you? That's it. We are both good kissers. <laughs> a note came from you from the... A note? The yeah, from the producer. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the tight camera there? <laughs> well, that's the tight camera there. Sorry you had to get it out. <laughs> And say hello to our champ, Beverly Reinhardt. Hi, Beverly. How are you? When time expired last time, Beverly had just finished winning her second game and was about to have a go uh, at the last half of the super match, right? right. You won the $500 in the audience match part of it, and you were going to go for the $5,000. She's got $950, and she's hopeful of winning more money. And we'll all keep our fingers crossed for you, Beverly. We'll get to that right after this. All right, here we go with Beverly Reinhardt. Are you ready, Beverly? Yes, I am. You know, you've been here before. You know how it goes. Don't back away from me. Just stand right there. You don't have to put your arms around me oh. or anything like that. I mean, I don't mind, but it's not required. Yes. We, uh... <laughs> We polled a recent studio audience, and we got their best response to... Oh, we've done all that, yeah. Oh, you've won the $500, you see? Oh, yeah. I think you put your arms around me once too often there. <laughs> well, you've won the $500, and you're going to play for 10 times that amount now, or $5,000. And to collect that amount of money, you must match one celebrity on a head-to-head -head basis, and it has to be an exact match. So please choose one now. Well, Brett... Oh. Brett. All right, Brett. Hi, well, she right. certainly is well, Brett. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, Brett. Well, you get ready to write, Brett, and uh, Beverly oh. will face me, and I'll get the $5,000 question. Here we go. It's a fill-in, uh, Brett. Fill in this blank, if you will, please. Hail blank. That's H-A-I-L blank. Hail blank or hail blank. Okay, Brett is finished, Beverly. Now it's up to you to fill in that blank. How would you do that? Hail Mary. Hail Mary? Well, I hope she helps you. <laughs> we'll find out right now whether she's on your side or not. Oh, Brett, what do you I say? I had not been raised a Baptist. <laughs> she said, Hail America. Yes. All right. I never thought okay. of that. Okay. Well, listen, you're up to $950, as you know, Beverly, and you're still a champ. You're going to meet another player and play another game. Let's meet that person now. Here is Shirley Klein. Hello, Shirley. Okay. You ladies know one another, do you? Uh, <laughs> Welcome, Shirley. Hi. Would you tell us a little bit about yourself? Well, I'm a native uh, Californian, and I'm married and have three children. Okay. You know how this game goes? Are uh, you ready to have a go at it? Okay. All right, I'll push the button, reveal two questions there, and ask you to make a selection. I'll take B. B for Shirley Klein. Everybody plays. Aladdin's girlfriend got blank on his flying carpet. 
Well, <laughs> Got a bunch of rap scallions in the studio audience there. Aladdin's girlfriend got blank on his flying carpet. <laughs> oh dear me. Surely it's up to you now to fill in that blank. Aladdin's girlfriend got blank on his flying carpet. What do you say? I'm gonna say lipstick. Lipstick. What are you lowing at her? She just started here. Now. Give her That's a chance. A good try. You never can tell. <laughs> Lipstick is her answer. Bill, what do you say? Aladdin's well, uh, the only one that I, everything I thought it was naughty. This is the only clean one I had was rolled. <laughs> rolled roll blanket. That's what it is. Rolled. You mean rolled up? Rolled. Oh, I see. Like yeah. like she got oh, rolled to roll. Rolled blanket. I thought you meant raw. <laughs> no, not Rob. Roll. You'll be okay, Bill. Take two aspirins and call us in the morning. They lay carpet, they roll That's people. Right. That's right. Brett, what did you say? <laughs> I don't know why you're applauding. We may have to take that out. <laughs> Brett? I think the world's gone too far too fast. Uh, and don't turn on that little cute darling girl. I said lipstick. Ah. Lipstick. Yeah. Okay, Shirley. What did you say? Shirley Klein is a nice Jewish girl and an Arab's blanket <laughs> and mattress. What is it, a flying carpet? <laughs> you should have seen what she did to his lamp. I also said lipstick. It's makeup. Makeup. Makeup is lipstick. Makeup is makeup. Lipstick. Do we get us? Oh. Does Shirley get us? No, he's doing very well with that. Yeah. Thanks. Aladdin's girlfriend got blank on his flying carpet. She said lipstick, and so did he. And what do you say? Well, I hope that this will qualify. I said makeup. Makeup, yep, there's another man. Wow, you're really going great here. What do you say, Richard? Well, I have a nose you did get uh, makeup on the carpet <clears throat> while she was getting pregnant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't really think he ever saw her again. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Judy, would you restore a little uh, sanity to this proceeding? Yes, she got pregnant because she was made love to. Made love to. Indeed. Okay. So that's three to nothing yes, in the middle of round one. Beverly, we'll get to your part of round one in a moment or so. But first, we've got to get to this, and then you hurry right back. Okay. Here we go with the second half of round one. Shirley scored three matches in her end of the round. And Beverly, we'll see how you do with this. Everyone participates. This is it. Mildred was arrested for blanking in Beverly Hills. <laughs> Mildred was arrested for blanking in Beverly Hills. I was arrested once for blanking in Beverly Hills. I'll tell you about it after this round is all over. <clears throat> We're off the air. <laughs> The lower tier is ready, upper tier. Uh, We're the band. You make me feel nervous. <laughs> okay. Now, Beverly Reinhardt, Mildred was arrested for blanking in Beverly Hills. What do you do with that blank? Street walking. <laughs> <laughs> you heard that she looking looking for her, her, isn't she? So <laughs> shy and demure. Street walking. Her answer is street walking. That's right. What do you say, Bill? Are uh, we introducing you to some uh, new aspect of television here? Yeah, I put uh, double walking. No, that's double parking. Double parking. Well, double yes, parking. okay. And Brett, what do you say? Well, I put what I got arrested for, which was speeding. Speeding. Which could be interpreted as street no, walking. No, no, wrong. <laughs> Because she ran over a streetwalker. <laughs> <what's it. laughs> Thank goodness our new mayor, Bradley, took all the streetwalkers off the street and put them where they belong in doorways. <laughs> I said streetwalking. Oh, yeah. Okay. Bless you, Beverly Reinhardt. Right. I've met you in many streets, Beverly. <laughs> what does Fanny Flagg say? Well, she was arrested in Beverly Hills for not wearing her Gucci shoes. No, that's not <laughs> <laughs> I said walking. Walking. On the streets, it's walking. Seriously? No, she's I just a street out. away. I is understand. that a match? Yeah. That's, yeah. yeah, it is a match. Walking, street walking, walking on the street. I was, that's, that, you know, I said I'd tell you about my, well, I was arrested once for walking. I went to a dinner party, when was going to walk back to the yeah. hotel, and a cop came and said, you can't walk in Beverly Hills. And so, isn't that interesting? What'd you do, get off your hands and knees? <laughs>
I thought street walking would be a little crude, so I said cruising. You cruising. Know, it's the same thing. Now, wait a minute. Now, hold, hold it. On. You're not the, we've got a very unsophisticated well, job. Well, now, if, there it is. if walk, oh, That's he gave right. it to you me? He gave it to you. Thank All you, Ira. Right. I'd never play yeah. backgammon with you again. Yeah. <laughs> oh, isn't cruising. this an education, folks? Here we All go right. with Judy. Judy. What do you say? My Mildred was very naughty, exposing herself in Beverly Hills. Exposing herself? Yes. Okay. So the score is tied three to three at the end of round one. We'll go to round two and ask Shirley to make her choice. Uh, I'll try A. A is what she wants. Last time out, you matched Fanny, Brett, and Jack, and now you'll be trying to capture the other three. Fanny, Brett, and Jack, you do nothing here. We lay out. Yes. <laughs> Fanny, Brett, and Jack, you lay out. <laughs> Listen now, folks. Nobody knows this. But when the little Dutch boy got tired of holding his finger in the dike, he stuck his blank in it. Now, lady, watch it. Check, you please. You gotta respond to this. I'm getting out of here. I can't even play. Am I one of those three that are not supposed to do this? No, oh, you I'm do it. Right you do it, yes. Brett from Hail Mary to this. <laughs> 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 all right. Oh, my. Shirley has probably already thought of her answer. We're all set now, so Shirley will call on you for your response. Nobody know this, but when the little Dutch boy got tired of holding his finger in the dike, he stuck his blank in it. I'm going to say his nose. His nose. All right. Good answer, right? Let's see if we get a nose over here from Bill Daly. What do you say, Bill? See what a nose can be. Look at your toe. His toe. There's another good answer. His nose or his toe. Uh, what do you say, Richard? He actually did put his toe in there and got water on the knee. Yeah, I put toe as well. Two toes. Oh, two toes. You had to be there. Yeah, right. toes or nose, <laughs> yes. Now, Judy Carr. I'm with you on the nose. Nose. So there is one match. Now we'll go to Beverly Reinhardt. Uh, you need one to score, two to win, however, and here it is. Let's see. Uh, Fanny, Richard, and Jack. This time, the street walkers lay out. Right. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Herbert said, Doctor, I have this terrible pain in my stomach. I think it's from swallowing my wife's blank. <laughs> Herbert said, Doctor, I have this terrible pain in my stomach. I think it's from swallowing my wife's blank. Oh. Brett and Bill and Judy. Well, Judy's already finished. Are you finished? Oh, I'm on this, too? I thought it was... Did it say don't write yeah. it? Doesn't yeah. say you don't write this. Oh, I got it. I think you yeah. right. I got to write it. Oh, uh, put his blank in his... Uh, uh, Herbert said, Doctor, I have this terrible pain in my stomach. I think it's from swallowing my wife's blank. I thought you were right, too. Come All on, right. Bill. We're waiting for you, Bill. I gotta do anything. I gotta say. Okay. So frustrating. Now, Beverly, I think it's from swallowing my wife's birth control pill. <laughs> no good. I don't know. We'll find out if it's any good or not. You need one to tie, two to win. What did you uh, finally think of, Bill? Uh, swallowing my wife's food. Food. Okay. No match there. Only kidding, dear. Uh, Brett. Well, I said food, too. Food. food too. Okay, now you must food match too. Judy to stay in the game. Let's see if it happens. Well, it's sort of in the food family. It's cooking. Yes. Cooking. No match there. So Shirley Klein is the winner. Congratulations, Shirley. Will you come down, please? Shirley. Congratulations to you, Shirley. You've got $100 to your credit, and Beverly Reinhardt has got a lot of money to her credit. She's got $950, together with our thanks for being on Match Game 73. Beverly Reinhardt. Bye, Beverly. Bye, Beverly. Now, you're going to have a go at the big money in a moment or so, but first, here's a message for you. Shirley Klein here has won one game. She's got $100. Now she's going to have a go at the big money in the super match. You ready, Shirley? I sure am. Okay, we polled a recent studio audience, and we got their best response to this. <laughs> Blank Hunt. Now, the answer they gave most often is worth $500 to you if you can match it. The second most frequent response, $250. And the third, $100. Which three celebrities would you like to get a little help from? I'll take uh, Brett. Sea Hunt. Sea Hunt is what Brett said. 
Okay, there's one answer. Uh, I'll take Dick. I've got I've Dick. Him. Take someone else. <laughs> no, Dick, what do you say? Well, no, if you take me twice, you get coleslaw. <laughs> <laughs> uh, manhunt. Manhunt. Okay, and I'll take uh, Bill. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> oh. Bill, how would you feel in that see, blank? I had, the, I had Sea Hunt already, but I didn't write it down. So I well. Just, okay, Sea Hunt's taken manhunt. Yeah. Um, treasure hunt. Treasure hunt. Yeah. Okay. So you've got Sea Hunt, Manhunt, and Treasure Hunt. You may choose one of those or give us one of your own. What would you like to do, Shirley? What is your judgment here? I'll try Treasure Hunt. Treasure Hunt, you think, is the most popular? Think it's under the 500? It's either that or Sea Hunt? Yeah. All right. Treasure Hunt is what we are looking for, folks. So let's see if it's up there somewhere. First, let's reveal the $100 response. Fox Hunt is a good answer, isn't it? All right. We're still looking for treasure hunt. Here is the $250 response. Sea hunt is up there. That's the one Brett gave you. Well, that may be a good omen, Shirley. Let's find out if it's under the $500 response. Here it is. Yeah! Treasure hunt. Very good. <laughs> okay. Now. You've got the $500, Shirley. That means you're going to play for 10 times that amount, or $5,000. Now, to collect, you've got to match one of those celebrities on a head-to-head -head basis. It must, has to be an exact match, and it's time to choose one now. Okay. Whom do you choose? I'll take Brett. Oh, no! You'll take oh, Brett, yeah. All right, Brett, get ready, Larry. Right? <laughs> Shirley is facing me. Here's the $5,000 question, Brett. Running blank. Running blank. All right, Brett is finished, Shirley. Now, how do you fill in that blank? Running? I'd say running water. Running water. Okay, Brett, for $5,000, may we see your response? I'm going to kill myself. I said running mate. Running so mate. so much politics in the paper. I so running mate. <laughs> it's all Nixon's fault. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Shirley, you've got $600. No one can take that away from you, and no one can take away the right to meet another player. Here comes Polly Kisling. Hi, Polly. You want to step up there now, if you would, please? I guess you ladies know each other, don't you? Polly, we welcome you. Would you like to tell us the story of your life in three sentences? <laughs> Well, I'm married, and I recently moved here from Michigan, and I have two cats and four parakeets. Really? They yes. get along, do they? Oh, beautifully. They're great huh. friends. Really are. Do the parakeets talk to the cats? They try. They really do. What do they say? <laughs> oh, you know, all kinds of Don't kill talks. me, they what? say. Don't kill me. <laughs> they say parakeets can't talk. Okay, Polly, if you're set, we'll begin. We ask you, the challenger, to make a selection. I'll take B. B is for Polly, and everybody plays because it's a brand new game. At the party, Jane said, she said, who is that over there with the blonde wig, the big high heels, and the fake eyelashes? And Dave said, good grief, that's my blank. <laughs> Isn't this fascinating, these oh, whole funny. stories? <laughs> Did you hear all that, Polly? I'll repeat it for you in a moment or so, because I like the sound of my own voice. Were you ever in show business? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Waiting for you, Jack. Always waiting. Okay. Polly, at the party, Jane said, who's that over there with the blonde wig, the big high heels, and the fake eyelashes? And Dave said, good grief, that's my... My wife. My wife. They think you're right. Let's see if the, you match the celebrities with that, Polly. First, Bill Daly, what do you say? Uh, I said, uh, that's my guy. <laughs> <laughs> it did happen in you Hollywood, out that. here, right? You, you said that, didn't my you? My guy. That's uh, what you wrote there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So far, I'm rolling with my guy. Where am yes. I going? <laughs> what do you say, Brett? <laughs> Well, I could have said wife, but my batting average being what it is, I said mother-in-law. Mother-in-law. <laughs> wife is the answer Polly's looking for. Jack? I happen to know, Dave, the party was a gay lib party, and he saw his boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Same okay. guy. Okay. <laughs> All right. Two of you match. Now, Fanny? I said that was my psychiatrist. 
You better learn to spell it. Wow. Okay. What do you got, that's fun, Richard? That's good. It's beautiful. Fun. Yes. Your father spent forty thousand dollars sending you to college, and you have two Z's in the word psychiatry. <laughs> Wife is the only Wife possible is answer. The answer. There's one match for Polly. Judy, do you score again? Yes, with... I went my boss. Mm-hmm. In drag. Boss. The boss is wearing yes. high heels. Okay, so it's one to nothing in the middle of round one. Shirley, we've got a question for you in this round, but first we've got this. We've run out of time, ladies. We'll look forward to seeing both of you next time when we'll have a question for you to finish up round one. Okay? Bye. All right. We've run out of time, folks. Oh. Oh. Another note came. Another for note came for me. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. Judy, this is your first go. Now you were on the the old match game, and uh, yes, years ago. Yes. yes, I was. And how do you like this? Thing? Oh, it's much more fun. Yes. Isn't it? Yeah. Well, we've enjoyed it. Oh, you've you? really hyped it up. Yeah. Good. I don't like being the last one all the time. Really? Yeah. Could you switch it? Well, for I me? never think of you as being last. <laughs> how kind. You're first in my heart. Uh, uh, can I say something? You may say something. Time? I want everybody to tune in tomorrow because I'm going to wear Fanny's present. <laughs> All I'm right. not going to be tell sure you to what in. it is. It'll be up be to sure you. Be sure to tune in next time. Gene Rayburn for Match Game 73. Bye. Bye. How could we possibly make lingo better? More money. We're getting real serious with this thing. It's the new bonus round progressive jackpot. Get a lingo on your first pull and win $12,000, $19,000, $28,000. Or more. Each show, Chuck will add $1,000 until someone takes the whole jackpot home. How high will it go? Man, it's a lot of money, I'm telling you. Find out on the new season of lingo. Tonight at 7.30 on GSN. The network for games.